Bill Wellington, uh, Michigan Open final champion here. You uh, knock off Sean Scott. How many times did you guys wrestle, by the way? That has to be like four or five, even six. We wrestled freestyle universities a couple times. We wrestled here a couple times, dual, turn Mac tournament. Old rival. Old rival. Knock off another Mac guy. Tough tournament. Um, tough semifinal. Yeah. Colin Moore? Colin Moore, he's a hell of an athlete. He's going to do some good, good things. He's an awesome, awesome kid. I actually coached him at Disney this year, so that was a little weird. So. You know, that match, that's a tough match. He pushes you hard. Mm -hmm. um, what do you take out of matches like that? A tough match with Scott, you win by a point. Uh, getting pushed early on, is that good for you? That's very good, yeah. I like getting pushed. Uh, we, uh, we strive for these, these big matches. You know, I mean, I mean, they're not huge, but I mean, they're still, they're still good matches. It just tells me that I need to go back to the, the drawing board, get a little better condition, working my shots a little bit, finishing, and just pushing myself all around. Looking at you know the Mid American Conference, you got you know Jaden Jaden Cox, NCAA champ, two-time All-American. You have a win over him. I don't know if a lot. Of, I think a lot of people must have forgot that, but you know knowing that you can compete with a guy like that, and I don't know if Jaden's put space in between you and him. You know if I'm speaking frankly, you know I think that you're right there. Yeah. Knowing you got a win over him, knowing you can compete with anyone in the country, is there any doubt in your mind you can't win a national title? No, there's no doubt in my mind at all. I've been preparing this for my whole wrestling career, so and I feel like it's my last year, my senior year. Ready to pull it all out there. You know, looking at the the NCA debacle with Taiwan Claxton, I couldn't disagree with it more. I know you, but 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 losing Taiwan, you know, the circumstances in which you lose Taiwan are just I don't I can't wrap my brain around it. But what's that do to the team? You know, and how do you guys replace a guy like Taiwan Claxton? Um, a guy like that is he's irreplaceable. He's a brother, so I mean, we grew up together. He's from ten minutes away from me, so losing a guy like that, it just it kind of hits home. But I mean, we have a uh, heck of a guy coming in, uh, Colin Cummings. He's uh, he's busting his ass, or <laughs> he's busting his chops in the wrestling room. So I think he'll. Uh, he's actually learning from Taiwan right now. Taiwan's still been around, you know, coaching him up, teaching him up, just, like kind of getting him ready to fill in that role. So I feel like we don't lose much. You know, looking at the senior class, you're in the senior class. Uh, looking at Sparty in the senior class. Looking at Walters. I think Romanchik's in the senior class. I mean, it, it's a good time. For, for the uh, the Bobcats to get in the top ten and have three or four All Americans, seven or eight qualifiers, what do you guys got to do to get there? Um, we just have to trust in our coaches and uh, stay disciplined, stay focused on uh, on the end goal. So we're already working hard. Just got to stay true to ourselves and uh, keep the band tight. We're a great group of guys. I think we can do it. Now, you know, looking at uh, the, you know the coaching staff, crazy turnover there. You know, uh, you guys, you get bring in two guys, you lose two guys, and bring in two guys. And three guys, actually, you know. Yeah. Kerr Brown is actually he's there in, like, kind of a workout partner capacity. But looking at the coaching turnover, what's that been like for you? Um, Coach, Coach Han it's, was it's, it Hanson left? Hanson, Jermaine. Jermaine Lindsay. Yeah. So we got Colt Sponseller. We got Eric Morrill. Uh, we got Manuel Kerr Brown coming in. Still got Taiwan. So, I mean, I feel like it's a good change of pace for us. Not to... Uh, Downplay, Coach Hanson, he's an awesome coach. He's taking me uh, as far as I can go. Um, but uh, this, this new coaching staff, they kind of bring a new mindset to the room. You know, they're, they're both younger, you know. Uh, so, I mean, I expect great things out of us. We've been already working hard. They've been uh, getting on us technical and getting on our uh, mental toughness. So, I think they're doing good things. All right, man, you got anything else for me? No, let's go back, Cats. All right, man, good luck this year. Thank you.